Ladies and gentlemen, and a very warm welcome to all of you to the Economic Times Best Brand Summit 2014, powered by Dawood. Well, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kavya R. Chavali, and I welcome all of you to this wonderful initiative that brings together the leading stalwarts and barons on a single platform as they discuss and deliberate on the pertinent questions surrounding the brand. Well, ladies and gentlemen, our writing instruments partner is Parker and our associate partner, Service Plan. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, on that note, as we're about to begin the summit, I'd also like to request all the members who are assembled here to be part of the action uh, by tweeting using the hashtag ETBestBrands. Let me repeat that one more time, ladies and gentlemen. Well, it's time to get your thoughts and your opinions on all the action that's surrounding the ET Best Brands 2014 using the hashtag ET Best Brands. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to give a wonderful head start to the summit, and I'd like to invite on stage the president of Times Conferences Limited. Can we have a warm round of applause as I welcome on stage Mr. Deepak Lambal? Ladies and gentlemen, a very uh, good morning to all of you and a very warm welcome to the inaugural edition of the Economic Times Best Brand Summit. Uh, I'll start off by quoting John F. Kennedy who said that leadership and uh, uh, learning are indispensable from one another. So personally for me, um, I'm really looking forward to today's sessions because uh, it'll give me an opportunity to pick the minds of some of the senior decision makers of uh, some of India's best brands and try and understand what is it that they have done, which is... Uh, prompted their brands to occupy leadership positions in this very highly competitive Indian marketplace. Um, so what is a brand? Uh, you know, what makes a brand great? Uh, some people always used to um, equate a great brand with great advertising, yet others would completely dismiss advertising from the equation and would talk about um, a great brand being one who, has, who ensures consistent quality over a tested period of time. Yet others spoke about uh, great brands being ones that um, are able to engage effectively with their consumers and, and are able to uh, build great customer satisfaction levels. Yet others spoke about great brands as being brands or companies who've, who've constantly strived for uh, innovation in whatever they do. But I think if you'll ask any um, decision maker or any leader of a successful brand, I think the answer will be fairly obvious. Uh, a great brand is not defined by any one thing that a company does, but is actually a summation of all the various things that a company does. Um, I can't resist quoting um, one of my favorite inspirational leaders, Jeff Bezos of Amazon, who, who made a beautiful analogy between um, a corporate brand and, and a personal or an individual's life. Um, he said it beautifully, and his words are very powerful and they've stayed in me, and he said, the, a brand for a company is like the reputation of a person. Um, you can build uh, or you can earn your reputation only by doing the hard things well over a period of time. Um, and I still remember his world famous quote by now uh, when he talks about measuring brands, which says, and he puts it so simply, um, that your brand is what other people say about you when you're not in the room. And I think today if you look at some of the biggest brands that, that surround us, um, you'll find this very simple statement to ring very, very true. However, um, so basically a brand is, is, is a promise uh, that they make to their consumers. It's not a process. Uh, we talk about, a brand talks about uh, saying that I will be there for you and I will not let you down um, and I will go that extra mile for you. But whilst all of that is very nice um, and all of the companies try and, try and achieve this, a, few, a very few companies actually succeed in making themselves being heard and seen over the din um, in the marketplace. Um, but for those who do, it's very clear result in tangible profits and most importantly, I think for me, the all-important intangible goodwill that a brand gets when it's able to do that. Um, I think the key challenge is how a company will align its very internal product core and merge it with its external messaging to ensure that the two are in sync and thus is able to effectively bond with the consumer. So. The answers to some of these questions, how do we do it, how, what makes a brand great, what do brands need to do to connect with consumers in the 21st century, uh, hopefully the answers to this and similar questions is what 
we will attempt to achieve um, here today with the Economic Best, uh, Times Best Brands Initiative. Uh, for some of you who are present in the room, you will know that uh, this initiative is a research-based initiative where we've partnered with Nielsen uh, to recognize the most admired brands in terms of five parameters, mainly uh, innovation, brand quality, uh, brand recall, um, customer satisfaction, and customer service. The initiative will fold, unfold as a day-long uh, series of discussions, uh, and we've got some fairly interesting topics lined up for you, such as um, five steps to build lasting consumer, uh, connect with consumers, or how do we take Indian brands global, uh, how do we connect with consumers in the 21st century, uh, all of which I'm personally looking forward to hearing from our esteemed panelists. Uh, in the evening, this will be followed by a gala evening where we'll unveil the first ever edition of the Economic Times Best Brands book. Um, which incorporates the key differentials of uh, the brands that we've shortlisted as among being, um, of being the best amongst the best, um, bases our exhaustive research. Uh, in the end, I sincerely wish that um, this initiative provides value to all of you who are present here and also to those who will manage to read or watch some of our uh, media platforms that are covering this. Um, and I wish you again a very, um, uh, a day which is full of insightful discussions uh, and learning. Thank you.